When we talk of um, pocket ships or ships perfect for pocket carriers, one of the first things that may come to mind are the snobs, the misc furies, and those other smaller ships. But there's one very unique ship which we have available. Now, this ship is unique because it's the smallest medical vehicle we have, and it can be an ideal addition to the fleet of your pocket carrier. And of course, I am talking about the Pisces C8R Rescue. It's ideal because it is the smallest medical vehicle. It is a very useful ship if you have a crew. It's not only for the bunker runners, although it is a very ideal ship for that role as well. Not to say that every carrier or pocket carrier will need this, because the newer and bigger ships will of course have their own medical stations, and perhaps can even offer imprinting, which the medical bed in the ship does not offer. But if you got a crew or a dedicated crew, and you're gonna pick something big, let's say Hercules C2, why not just keep it down at the hangar with the other ships? I mean, it's big enough, it doesn't take up too much space, and yes, you can even store it at the back of the Corsair, although be it a really tight fit. Given if you are setting up yourself, let's say, dedicated ship combat with some snobs, this ship might not be that much of use to you. This is a ground combat support, let's be honest. It's not meant to fight, it's not meant to brawl, it's just there to support you, help you and assist your team members. But if everything you're doing is ship combat, yeah, I can see how this ship can be somewhat of a wasted space. But still, it's a very unique ship for this size to have a medical bed medical station. And yes, there are bigger ships with better medical stations, but this is what we have available and which we can store at the back of some of these bigger ships. And if your team members are doing ground assaults or bunker runs, why not bring it with you? Because there are some really annoying medical conditions that uh, can apply to you once you've taken too much damage with a certain body part. And even if there is a team member to pick you back up, yeah, you might need some extra healing right there. At the moment, there really isn't a direct need for you to have this ship. But it is a good addition depending on the content you are enjoying. It's not gonna be ideal for combat, it's... Uh, well, it can take on light fighters, it's not gonna be ideal for that. And that is on the account of this ship's maneuverability. Of course, its firepower is quite small as well compared to most other fighters. It is a designated role ship and it's fit for a perfect role of this size ship or even this series. I've often stated that the Pisces uh, C8R is the best of its kind. I don't really see the reason why you would have another Pisces ship instead of this one. They are not that great, there are other light fighters you might go for, but this specific role with this ship is just ideal. A perfect addition to any fleet. And I'll leave you with that. Anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe and thanks for watching.